welcome back to Avo Tutorials. Today I would like to show you something really cool that you can do on Figma which is removing the background from an image. Alright, first things first, we will need to get an image and I usually head to pixels.com, P-E-X-E-L-S dot com and just search any image that you like. So right now I would just like to have a stretching image and this lady here one looks good so I'm going to download it. Now, once you have that downloaded, you can drag it into Figma. So, let me drag this into Figma after you download it. Alright, there we go. So, I would like to have this um, lady who is stretching cropped out without the plant and also the grey background. So, how do we do that? First things first is to use the pen tool over here on the top left. So make sure you have your pen selected and not the pencil and you just need to start tracing out the part of the image that you like. So I'm just going to start from her arm over here and slowly just trace out the area that you like to crop out. Okay, I'm going to fast forward this so that we don't spend too much time here. Alright, now as you head towards the end of um, selecting your outline make sure you connect the dots and have everything selected and click done okay now you can see that the lady has been traced out which is the area that we would like and you can see on the left here the vector has already been created all you have to do is switch the positions of having the image on top of your vector and then select both layers and create a mask so use as mask, the middle icon over here. Don't worry if you see your image disappear, make sure you have vector selected and then fill that in. You can remove the stroke. All right, now you have your image that you have cropped out and you can see the background is no longer over there. If you need to move this around, make sure you select the whole mask group. You can even decollapse this. So Select the whole mask group and you can have this anywhere you like in your visuals. And there you go. I hope this tutorial was helpful. Do drop a like, comment and subscribe to my channel. Let me know in the comments below if you have any other videos that you'd like me to do. Thank you. Bye.